So what is it that came to mind? Why did this jump out at you? I know you said you lived on two sides of the coin. What specifically can you point to? So, yeah, I'll talk about me on it in a bit retrospectively and then a couple of other thoughts I've got on it. So I have done that. I have lived that where I want a car that is just completely out of my means whatsoever. And I've got a car and quite often it was a good car. But I would want something that just wasn't obtainable at that time or wasn't necessary at that time. So you're, you're never grateful for what you've got. It's always just, oh, one day I'll have that. One day I'll have that. You're always living vicariously through this imaginary version of yourself in the future where something's... You know, it wasn't... I wasn't I wasn't aspiring to achieve something and then that was a byproduct of it. I was aspiring for the material thing. It wasn't, you know, that, and that's... I don't think we've talked about it in multiple podcasts. I don't think that's ever a healthy thing to do. And I and I've, I have lived that life where you are always kind of wishing, and it is wishing's a word, wishing for that that material thing that you haven't got that you want to have. And it does. I think it completely puts the blinkers onto what you actually do have and what is around you. And I have. I, I spent a lot of my, you know, my life as is now in that place doing that sort of thing. And I think I'm on the other side of that coin now. There's an ironic thing that I if the right word is, I have more now than I did when I looked at that, when I was that sort of person. But I don't necessarily have the things I was aspiring to then that were like out of reach, but I'm definitely appreciative for everything I do have right now. It's gonna be, I'm no, I don't have that, I don't know, struggle in my head that I don't, I'm not that person I imagine myself being in my head because now I am the person I want to be and I'm grateful for what I've got. I'm probably not articulating it very well, but you get where I'm going with that. And I am on that side now. And it's a, you know, gratitude thing we talked about a lot. And it's no one like defining moment where I change from one to the other. I'm just very consciously aware that my brain doesn't work exactly the same as it used to. (laughs) 